on weakness for nine months long telling herself it would all be worth it soon as she rest assured for when she finally made it through to that hospital ward it was love at first sight the second she saw it's beautiful me What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Esther and you're welcome back to another reaction video. If you're coming across this channel for the first time, you're super welcome. Join the Crown Royal Squad by liking, subscribing and turning on your notification bell so you get notified whenever I drop any beautiful video on this channel. And if you want to, if you feel like joining my super hype members, I have Royal Squad Gold silver and bronze and you so much enjoy the goodies being my membership and to all of my amazing subscribers you guys are so dope so love this i'll be reacting to spoken word official video and this is titled dear mom this is requested and i can't wait to see this without further ado let's dive into the video to the woman that loved me hmm. before i was born To the woman that held my heart long before it had formed. To the woman who was left sleepless from dusk until dawn with weakness upon weakness for nine months long. Telling herself it would all be worth it soon as she rest assured for when she finally made it through to that hospital ward it was love at first sight. The second she saw it's beautiful. me. I mean, she's a type that would give up her only slippers just to make sure that my toes were warm. See, she would Amazing. always favor me despite the fact she always needed it more. She would wake up early every single morn to stand freezing in the cold, hanging up the clothes we had worn, standing at the stove for hours, cooking bowls of food we would swarm. And whenever we weren't home, her heart would be torn. I mean, she could never ever sleep whenever we were gone. She would stay up all night next to the phone, although I would never call. So she sends me text messages, please, I can't sleep. Just let me know that you're safe and secure. And whenever I was sick, she would always know what was the cure. I mean, the love she gave to me was the best medicine that was pure. A prescription of tea, honey, and handmade lemonade. What more could I ask for? Alhamdulillah. Oh, praise to the Lord. You did it all for me and not once ever asked for a reward. I mean, I still remember the nights when I was small. I could never go to sleep until I would call to you out from the bedroom door. Ghatini were both seen. Tuck me in and kiss me, please. And you would always be there for sure. See the love you gave to me for all these years. It's impossible to ignore. I love you, Ya Ummah. And I'm sorry I've never told you all this before. Mm. I'm sorry for everything, mum. I'm sorry for it all. I'm sorry for leaving you as soon as you taught me how to crawl. I'm sorry for saying oof every time you would ask me to complete a simple chore. It doesn't make me less of a man to give you a hand whenever your arms get sore. I'm sorry again and again for all the promises I fell short. And I'm sorry I can't give you the life you wish for. The cart you dreamt of and the countries you wish to explore. But most of all, I'm sorry for all the pain that I caused. For the nights you didn't sleep and for all those missed calls. For all the fights we had and for all the broken walls. The dirty room with the messy floors and for the clothes that weren't packed back into their drawers. And for all the sacrifices you made that I never once ever recalled. Like when you became my mother. It meant that you had to move away from yours. I know how much you love her and miss her and I know it cuts you deep like a sword. But if it was up to me, I'd let you see her as much as I can afford. So I promise to make it up to you and become the son that you've always adored from now on. So forgive me. Forgive me for it all. Forgive me for everything I've ever done Ever since I was young, stupid and dumb Just looking to have fun Dear mom I love you I love you 
I promise to never put anybody else above you Nor let anybody come in between And even if I get married I promise you will always be my queen Because there's no words in this world that can let you know how much you really mean To me Nor is there anywhere in this world that I could ever repay you So instead I pray every day for you That Allah has mercy on you The same way you had mercy on me and I have one last request for you before you leave, please. Since Allah put paradise beneath your feet, please ask Allah to let paradise be the place where we finally meet. Amen. Wow, this is so emotional at the same time, so beautiful. I'm a mom and I understood the, the, the sleepless night, the pain in the labor room, the dirty clothes, the chores, the, the, the dirty rooms, the junks of choice you get to wake up to every blessed day. It's not a joke, guys. And um, to every mom out there, I, I celebrate you and I pray may we all eat the fruits of our labor. And lastly, his last comment, you know, in um, Islam, they believe your, your heaven is at the feet of your parents, that is your mom and your dad. And that, that was his prayer that, um, that may Allah, uh, may she um, like tell Allah to help him be in our journal so they can actually marry together and have fun and like mother and child that was so beautiful that's a very beautiful spoken word i love this thank you that person for suggesting this video i really do enjoy it don't forget to request for any video you like me to react to drop that at the comment section with link or full title check other videos i've reacted to and i'll see you in my next video signing out Ciao!